it's not no. I think I think I may be mistaken. It's Jonathan Isherwood trying to get get me to uh, spec this game because there we go. Uh, they're both in Champion Select at the moment. Um, ah, we have the bans. Um, Adele has chosen to ban Nami, Master Yi, and Riven. Um, and Jonathan has chosen to ban Misfortune, Annie, and Timo. Mm. Tito. There's the Tito ban. Nobody wants the Tito. Uh, which reminds me, I've got to update the data from the last game that we've just had, but I can't do it yet. So I'm going to have to... Is the first time Lux has been played in this tournament? Uh, I'm not sure, actually. Let's have a quick look at our Twitch stream. Uh, Pre Prezi Ham asking to raise your dongas. Apparently you, you want people to raise your dongas. Ray, Ray responding with, play your dongas. Okay, I'm they are now this. in game, uh, so we can go into the, uh, the lobby. Oh, there's some more Kate. Uh, Kate versus Renekton. And Jonathan has chosen to play Renekton. That classic mid lane matchup. This is going to be an interesting game. Uh, Adele choosing the flash barrier, uh, whilst Jonathan ignite barrier, which uh, probably. Probably wise from both sides. So, let's have a look at the Bengals and Masteries. Uh, my High has gone with the attack damage marks. The attack damage this is flat armor seals, which is brutal and it is reacted. And magic is per level plus, uh, which will we'll roll up against. Uh, Do we rely on that? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty standard, 2190. Uh, though it does have quite some wrath, uh, which is a great help, but uh, she hasn't taken It's called Tank for Attack Counters. Seals. Magic resist per level. Uh, magic resist per level glyphs, uh, which isn't going to help him uh, against Caitlyn. Sick net damage, man. And all oh, the sick net damage. Oh yeah. Once you you know once he gets to level nine and they become better than flats. Uh, and twenty six uh, health from each of those greater quintessences of health. Uh, so it all depends on whether. Well. It all depends, this match is all going to depend on whether um, Jonathan can get on top of Adele. <laughs> that sounds like a horrible thing to say. Once again, no flash taken. No flash a lot of people opt for Barrier Ignite. Mm -hmm. Well, bo both champions do have um, a gap closer. Uh, Renekton's is a little more reliable. If oh, you sick get Kate gap closer. <laughs> sick Kate, Kate gap closer. Uh, not that Kate really needs a gap closer. She does have the range. Right, uh, and the game begins. Uh, Games begin. Seem to be lower on watches for this game. Only six watches. I don't know if people. Uh, oh. Now, according to Ray, the lol game is loud and Nick is so quiet. I'll speak <coughs> a bit louder then. Jesus Christ, you guys are never going to be happy with the volume level. If you get the vo volume level right, they'll be happy. The problem is, is you you're coming through Teamspeak, uh, which is on one volume setting. The game is also on the same volume setting. Uh, so, to increase you, I've also increased the game. I come through on a microphone volume setting, so us two are different, 
me and the game are different, but you and the game are the same. So in order to increase you, I've had to increase the game. And lowering me has meant the game is now louder than me. Um, so oh dear. I can change. I can change that. There's only the, it's only because the login. I, w I won't change it because it's. I think Welcome it's fine in game. It's just the login wind. screen. Uh, it's very loud. Uh, but unfortunately, you can't mute it. Do you know when someone picks Kate that they're just going to be like, "Oh, I'm going to aim for farm." <laughs> Yeah, I think we can probably guess uh, that Adele will be going for the CS victory, whereas Renekton will be trying to... What is this pansy-ass Renekton, honestly? Health, Quince, and the Doran Shield. <laughs> Doran Shield won part. 30 yes. seconds well, until minions spawn. Again, against Kate, he's, he's going to have problems with her poking him down. Uh, so taking that Doran Shield is going to mitigate quite a bit of the initial damage. Um, I can't, you know, I can't deny that Darren Shell against Kate is actually, you know, off, but... The health quintessence is... What's manly about that? You if he get, if crocodile. He gets, the question is now, is if he gets on top of her, is he going to have enough damage to kill her before that she can, before she can get away? Remember, he has, got to has go, he has got to go through her net shot, her flash, and her barrier. I think might always be a tit and stand on a trap. <laughs> Interestingly, um, I, I, when I played uh, a 2v2, I managed to get Caitlyn uh, in a game, and I still took traps first and started going into the brushes and putting traps down. I'm not quite sure why, because it really wasn't that useful. Mm. Um, not a fun of mana. Still, still not the, the craziest skill option that we've seen in this tournament so far. Shenol. It's no Shenol. Double farm. Yeah. Already ahead on the CS. Uh, I need my missing a couple of those early, early shots. You have to remember they are both in the losing bucket. Uh, they've gone from the field only more by default. Uh, we, can all, we can already see the we can already see the difference between from their positioning. Renekton is nowhere near. Uh, well, it's like in the previous game, like Renekton's not going to have to do much until he gets through. No. Certainly once Renekton gets six, gets six we can definitely expect to do it. Uh, Adele, staying safe, just going to the CS. Pushed quite well up to lane. And that's going to be that's going to be another problem for Renekton here. It's really not going to be difficult for him to poke away. Uh, Renekton will Though without having any mana problems, this is Renekton shouldn't be. It was a bit of a there. Go on. Yeah, fair enough. A little bit of damage. Though Adele, Adele with the with the orange blade is going to be able to sustain that back up. Uh, no life still quince though. No life still quince. Just, just the five per hit. Uh, and Renekton has already popped his pot, so he does have the health. Uh, so, so far we can see uh, High 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 hasn't taken a point in the traps, which is probably wise. Uh, not really much use for the traps. Uh, in this game. That's not true. Well, you can do. Uh, it just it depends when you can get it down in a position where the only the only real I think the only real use that you're gonna have for them is if you're being chased you can put one down with them you either have to wander around or in the Again, the Not seeing that as a good trade for an Exon, like <laughs> took quite an equal amount of damage from minions there. And so. still taking uh hiding high are a little lower man. So it all depends on whether she's gonna keep keep using his or uh, using that next shot to get away. Uh, Renekton is ahead on farm at the moment. Uh, only I'm only by one though. Only by one. So it's not really worth and it. And the pretty close. Another 
are engaged by Renekton, you will completely shut down by the next shot. I imagine we'll see that a lot. I think the only thing Renekton could have done in this in this case, if he, if he knew what the battle was going to be, um, he certainly would have chosen to take it. Here we go again. Uh, he does get the stun off this time, but not before Adele can uh, get the next one. I'll slowly take him back over with that Doran shield as well. Going once again. And stun, and there's the next shot. Uh, Bezel. Renekton has hit six. Uh, Caitlyn's still only at level five. Hmm. <laughs> I just thought Kate's got to be good in 1v1 because no one can block her ult. <laughs> I really she considered that. that. Down, there's no way that she's going to be able to stop it. Uh, so it looks like uh, Renekton's going to choose to go back now. Uh, a bit of gold to spend. Uh, one would assume he's going to go and get some damage because he hasn't got. Apart from the attack damage he hasn't marked, he hasn't got any. Oh no, no, he's bought a chain he's vest. He's bought a chain vest. So, whether or not he's going to have enough damage to kill people. Oh no, there's some, there's some sick deeps. Uh, but it's going to. Ah, and there's the Doran's Blade. He's so got the Doran's Blade up in. Doran's Blade and the Doran's Blade. should really go back. He has still got sustained power, so back to bar. Yeah, but he'll push this really so easily. Yeah. He's down on items now. But for the, but for the time being, it's probably safe to assume that's the CS at the tower. Uh, for the time being, it is safe to assume that if Renekton does try to jump on top of her, she's just going to net away, and no amount of Doran's blades or armor is going to Help but despite having sent the to back, he hasn't uh, used that to get a shot. Mm -hmm. uh, the next is taking a couple of power shots, which is going to be uh, the next slow there. The armor is also going to be useful if he does want to try and dive. Again, I don't, I'm not using those headshot rocks. Uh, for us just to keep getting the CS. She's clearly going for the CS. Either that or she's going to try. She is intending to push it. She's not to. The only hope that she seems to be putting down is that she's going to About to reach the uh, 8 minutes 22 into this game now. Uh, That's round time, man. Go back here or? She's, well, she's sitting on nearly 2,000 gold as well, so... Not really enough to get any form of armor pen. Uh, which... Oh, Barrier's pop. And Adele is now on pretty much no mana at all. Still hasn't, and still not taken any points in uh, there. Not, not to go back now. Not See what she picks up. Uh, she should have quite a bit of gold to spend, so we'll be able to 
two more Dorance Blades and Boots, that's going to help uh, with that disengage as Renekton still has quite more mobility. That's four Dorance Blades, that's going to provide him with a lot of sustain. It's going to help the last hitting, uh, which is we've seen so far, particularly under the tower. Yes, that's another, another tower here Hello, whilst mate. farming for Renekton. <laughs> Maybe a bit late in the fact that, like, what Renekton's... Like 20 if I'm ahead now. So it's now a question of whether whether she is gonna Saying that, if she can force him back here, she might just have to take the tower with, with so many four, Dorans. With four Dorans blades, uh, it won't be difficult to take the tower at all. Uh, though she is going for the poke. There's the ult. There's the ult. On the wrong side of him, she isn't able to. She's not being able to get that catch away. Uh, did she use the net shot on that engage there? No, I didn't see it. Mm -hmm. Opting to use the ultimate, which. Uh, Poke him a little. There's the flash. There's the flash. The next thing with the knife is already down, he only has the carrier off. Uh, Adele now in real danger here. She's not got a lot of health, but if she chooses to go back, then I think mm -hmm. Renekton can probably win. Uh, uh, no summon spells for, for Adele either. Though she does have four Doran's Blades, which should give her, should help her with the CS, but Renekton's certainly going to As soon as he gets close to one of the minions, though, he can dash through, like he's doing now. Round one goes to Renekton. Not enough mana left for the next shot to go. A summoner has disconnected. Alright, <clears throat> so that's 1 0 up at the end of uh, game one for uh, Jonathan Isherwood. Uh, we will. Where are they at the moment? Hi, hi, hi. Is online. But yellow for some reason. Uh, ah, creating custom games, so they are about to uh, to join. I'll be right back, Nick. Very I'll join you. I'll I'll stay in this channel and I'll join you when the stream actually starts. Okay, okay. Uh, Milo says I like saying that I'm very quiet. I need to turn the game down a bit. Uh, and I'm very quiet. Turn that something up or the game down. Okay, I'll go back to my microphone options and I'll turn myself back up again. Uh, it, it seems I just can't get the right balance at the moment. I'll put myself. I'll put myself back up to a hundred. So, as I say, I have it. I have explained the reasons why some of these volume controls are uh, are causing issues. But celery. So we go into the second game. Jonathan Isherwood one nil up. Um, I think we'll. Pr I, I wouldn't be surprised uh, if we see him banning Caitlyn. Uh, we'll have to wait and see what whether uh, Adele chooses to ban Renekton or not. Okay, I'll I'll turn the game down slightly, Milo, when we're back in. Uh, Ray talking about the uh, the Caitlyn snap trap, um, saying the snap trap's needing the snap trap just defeated Fizz, so I think we've proved the power. When was that? Oh yeah, did Fizz step on Fizz steps on the trap there? So just waiting for them to get into the game, and um, we'll join them in Champion Select. Uh, remember, this is losers bracket. So whoever, if Adele now loses the second game, it does mean that she's out of the tournament. Um, and uh, it seems I have the bands. They're just doing bands at the moment. Uh, so we should be joining them in their second game in a couple of minutes. Uh, the stream seems to be a bit quieter for this one, only seven people watching uh, as opposed to the 14 or 15 that we've had 
previously. Though this, I'm streaming reasonably early in the day uh, compared to streams that we've had in the past. Oh, that reminds me. One thing I do need to do. Oh, gee, it's not online anymore. That's. I'm gonna have to find out the bands from them again. Oh well. Uh, so James should be joining us uh, again shortly. So just waiting on the bands. Um, what can I say to? Uh, let's. Uh, I'll go. I'd go to the comments, but there's not really a lot of comments happening apart from that. Uh, there's some talk about the the previous game with uh, Fizz, the Fizz Caitlin uh, match up in the two v two. Milo talking about last ticket of ignite is actually what killed him, but a snap trap facilitated it all. Um, update from the update from the level one. I'm assuming that's where you say other one going on now with Alfie versus Oliver. Um, I'll have a look and see if they're in game at the moment. Uh, yes, um, they're in their second game. Alfie is playing as Lux, uh, and. Ollie is playing as Cassiopeia. Uh, there are 11 minutes in currently. It, I can assume, I'll assume that's game two. Obviously, we don't know who won the first game. Uh, the bands are for this one uh, Caitlin, Renekton, Misfortune, Nami, Annie, and Master Yi. So we won't be seeing either, either of Caitlin or Renekton again. Uh, they're cur they should be currently in Champion Select, if I can find either of them. There we are, they are in Champion Select at the moment, so we'll be, we'll be joining them. Uh, Milo there saying, Alfie just won the second round with a tower kill. Uh, so I can assume, uh, one can assume then that that makes them 1-1 one -one going into their last game. Uh, so we know that their first game was Ari versus Varus. Their, their third game is uh, Cassiopeia against Lox. We don't know what their second game is. Uh, I think that slight sneeze, I'm going to assume it was, uh, suggests that James has returned. Hello. Hi, James. Game's still in Champ Select? Uh, they're just in Champion Select. I, I've already said it, but for, for your benefit, the bands, unsurprisingly, are Caitlyn and Renekton. Uh, Miss Fortune, Nami, Annie, and Master Yi. Someone doesn't like Nami. Someone definitely doesn't like Nami. Okay, and they are in game. So let's go into Champion Select now. Uh, that's Zed being played by Jonathan Isherwood there, and Tristana, interestingly, being played by. Uh, no barrier this time. No barrier for the Trist. The, there's the, the Flash Ignite. Uh, and Zed opting for same again, uh, barrier and. Uh, I wonder now whether obviously Zed could just insta kill a squishy at six. Mhm. Mm but so can Trist if she builds AP. If she does build AP, that is a possibility. But even without like you know building AP, Trist's like base damage at six is pretty high. As well as you can, you know, poke him down 3 6. I can't see this one going to farm, I'll be honest. Someone's dying. Someone probably will end up dying. Again, I think the only issue we're gonna, the only issue we're gonna have here is that oh, it's the same as the last game. Uh, Zed tries to jump on Tristana, but Tristan is going for Tristan to escape without uh, flashing his horse. He does have a gas laser, uh, but yeah, it's probably not going to be enough. Though he does have uh, the, the slow with his E. Uh, so which yeah, but you're also forgetting that rocket jumps mana cost is ridiculously high early on. Rocket jumps mana. The fact that she has like 8 mana to start the game with. <laughs> uh, I, I haven't looked at runes and masteries yet. Uh, there is a bit of time left. Well, you look at Zed, I look at Trist. Uh, so, for Zed, uh, a different, mana pa different rune page from the one we saw in playing as Renekton. Attack damage marks, attack damage quintessences, 
uh, flat armor seals and magic resist per level glyphs uh, the masteries 2190 taking that extra uh, point for the improved barrier and then if we have a look at Tristana's though we can probably probably guess that they're similar unless she's she is indeed going for the ability power uh, magic pen marks AP uh, quintessences armor seals and magic resist per level glyphs uh, and then in the masteries uh, a full AP page 2109 the extra mana uh, in the utility tree hasn't taken out that extra point in runic affinity uh, but does have the extra point in uh, in ignite uh, so uh, as you suggested there James he is going for the uh, for the AP build Uh, Milo asking if I can turn down the client volume. I've already so I've already spoken about this. I can't turn down the client volume. There's no way of me doing it. The only way I can do it is to turn down that volume setting, which would also turn James down and doesn't work. Hmm. Turn me down a bit if you want. I can always just speak uh, louder. Milo, Milo also, I can't I can't turn you and the client down separately. You're together. No, I'm saying if you turn us both down, I'll just talk louder. Oh, okay. Sorry. Um, Milo saying that we need a, they need a judgment call on the other game. Uh, I haven't had to do a judgment call yet. It's also hard to say because we didn't nobody spec that game, did they? No. What, did they both kill each other while someone got a hundred CS? Or uh, might I ask him if he can, he can put it? Don't. Uh, we won't talk about it now. As this game uh, is going the way. So I'll I'll get to uh, I'll I'll get to that once this game has ended. Uh, so Trist already straight into lane with uh, still choosing the the Doran's blade over the. Oh, Doran's you see that on a you see that on AP Trist anyway. Early on, see a lot of it. Well, you see AP Trist start Doran's blade start at a which is to be expected. Uh, Zed not taken a, hasn't taken a point yet. Starting with the, starting with the cloth five, uh, which isn't going to be as useful because he hasn't no won't have noticed yet. Particularly with her starting Doran's blade, won't notice straight away. Um, that she's going for AP builds. Well, there's more. Yeah, she's, she's still gonna. Even so, the cloth's still good because she's still, you know, you're still gonna get auto attacks as a melee she against Tristana. Have, she does still have a Doran's blade as well, which is giving her some extra attack damage. Uh, so Minions have spawned. And the parts are gonna help because he is gonna get poked down with autos and with them. Um, Particularly with the explosive shots. Uh, so should this should be a very interesting game. Um, quite different from the last one, considering uh, the the difference in champions. Someone's gonna uh, die. Apparently, so. the issue in the other game has now been all sorted out, so I don't need to worry about it. Good. The less for me to worry about this tournament, the better. I already have enough to worry about. <laughs> so the minions join each other and they're off. Uh, unsurprisingly, uh, Jonathan's chosen to start with the Q so that he can. Uh, can get that farm without having uh, mana to worry about. Uh, farm all day with his Q if he likes. Obviously, the the one disadvantage we're going to see for Tristana here is she can't make full use of that passive uh, as that really uh, starts to, to kick in late game. They're already taking a lot of damage from the explosive shot, though. That is quite a bit of damage already. Uh, I think I think just for First that he'll probably be probably checking up to see why uh, why that did so much damage to him. But that's already one pot used. Of course, the other advantage that this um, is going to have is with him having five pots. Uh, if he pops the pot and then this uh, can get that explosive shot down onto him, uh, it's going to reduce the heat from that pot. Thanks to the extra, the extra ability there from explosive shot. Uh, so uh, both uh, Tristan already level three. She's got a point in the uh, 
Oh, I can't see that being a good choice. Like, no, taking the, taking rapid the fire is not going to do much for you at level 1. No, taking the point in the queue probably isn't that useful. Uh, if we don't have a quick look at it. Like said again, uh, <laughs> Yeah, well, that's understandable for Zed. Mm -hmm. that shot again. A lot of damage. Actually not, I don't know, that doesn't seem to be as much damage as the last one. Maybe it's just that he sustained it a bit. Well, it's because he's got an extra level and she didn't oh, put yeah, a second point into it. Jab them now. Putting down the... She should be looking, she should be looking to put that E on whenever she can, where she is now. There's the, the mana cost for the E. 60 mana, not as high as it's the rocket jump that really causes the, the mana issue. Yeah, but by leaving it at level 1, it doesn't really do too much. But is maximum I think at the moment, said, I think Zed's going to be looking to try and all in or in 6 because at the moment he's just. Yeah, well, he's popping a pot with the human debuff on him, like you're saying. Another shadow slash that's made. I don't think Adele's taken any help. Oh, there we go. I think that's the first bit of damage Adele's taken so far. No, she, she took like a Q earlier, but then just sustained it back up. CS. Uh, again, Adele, despite being real, is still very behind. Uh, yeah, that's no issue farming now. Take, Take a lot of damage from me if she attacks him here. Shadow Slash. Uh, oh, uh, so taking the tower shot. Is Adele going to try and make the most of this? But no, she's not going to be able to with the W. Not without ult. No, not without ult, yeah. I think by this point, um, uh, it looks like Adele might just tick six first. If she can tick six first and then go in instantly with Ignite, then she might get the kill. But if Zed gets ult, then obviously, right, she should go now. But now, Zed's backing off. If Zed gets ult, then he can obviously. Yeah, he can you know go untargetable and avoid a chunk of the damage if he plays it right. Very quickly. Yeah, oh, she's panicked and ran. She could have killed him quite easily. Uh, He's got 500 health. Plus, the shot like 300 level one anyway. Hesitated, yeah. hesitated too much. For the old man. No flash or the W to try and get away. Um, so that's a that's a two nil win for. Uh, for Jonathan Ishwood, well played to him. Unfortunately for, for Adele, that means she is now out of the tournament and won't take any further part. Uh, Jonathan Isherwood loses his first game by default and then continues on into the, um, into the loser's bracket. So, well played um, to him. Unlucky for, for Adele there. Thank you guys for watching. Again, James, thank you for um, casting with me so quickly after the first one. No problem. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Buddy left your channel.